Nope. That cheddar. Dang it! What? Boy, was you asleep? I mean, I was, but mom, you know, you just did wake me up, so. Yeah. I'm up now, so what is it? What's up? Okay, so since today's Saturday, that means it's Saturday cleaning. Uh, what was that? Nothing. Mm, yeah, that's what I thought. Anyways, like I was saying, before I was rudely interrupted, I only want you to do a few things around the house. I want you to wash the dishes, clean the dirty clothes, clean your room, clean the bathroom, sweep the ceiling, clean the pool, go onto the roof and touch it, turn on and turn off the TV, and those are just the list of things that I still have planned out on the list on the left, the left you on the refrigerator. You can go check it after you're done with the rest of the chores that I just told you to do, alright? Mom, doing all those chores? Mom, it's Saturday, I just want to sleep in. Boy, I don't care. You gonna do chores. After all this summer, you ain't gonna be just slumped up in my house talking about some summer vacation. Nah, boy, you gonna do these chores and you gonna do them when I say, you understand? Okay, chill out. Jeez, I'll do the chores. That's what I thought. Get it done and get it done now. Well, might as well go ahead and get around of some gaming in. Now, should I play PlayStation or Oculus? Should I play my PlayStation or Oculus? You need me to my Oculus. <sighs> Alright. <laughs> Yo, you on? Put Tom and Jerry back on. Ain't nobody wanna watch those stupid Teen Titans go. Like that show's overrated. Oh, looks like it's time to check up on Aiden. All right, let's see if he did all the chores like I asked him to do. All right. Ugh. Oh, oh, so we didn't do the dishes, huh? All right, bet that up. Okay, to make the door to do his chores, he better do this one. Okay. So he didn't clean the pool either. Mm. The boy's really pushing it today. Pushing my limits. So far, this boy hasn't cleaned the dishes or cleaned the pool. This is the last thing. Okay, let's check if he sweep the ceiling. sweep the ceiling. He didn't do any of his chores. Dude, come here. No, dude, when I come over there, I'm gonna smack you. Okay, stay still. You ready? Three, two, one. I'm, I'm okay. Is he dead? Mom. Aww. Mom, what are you doing in here? Oh yeah, boy, um, what was that thing that was just on your head when I walked in here? Wait, mom, do you mean this? Oh, this is my Oculus, my MetaQuest 2, my virtual reality, my VR headset. <laughs> yeah, it's the best thing ever. Not sponsored. Anyways, mom, why are you even in here? Oh, right! Why am I in here? Oh, let me think. Um, you didn't do your chores. What? Oh, mom, what was that for? Oh! So boy, you really had the decision to just choose to not do your chores, even though I asked you nicely. Well, now I'm being mean. I'm sorry, mom, I was just tired, and I was trying to play my game. You know how serious I have to take it. Listen, I didn't told you to do all your chores, especially sweep that ceiling, because that ceiling is crusty, dusty, musty, and rusty. So I'm gonna need you to go clean that ceiling. And I'm gonna need you to wash the dishes and clean the pool too. But since you didn't do any of that, I just had to give you a taste of your own medicine, what it feels when you don't do your chores, even though you just got whooped. Either way, next time, do them when I ask you. Do you understand? I mean, no, because, like, you just want me to do chores so badly, like, all I, I didn't do three chores, and you whooped me into the wall. Why do you want me to do chores so badly in the first place? Because if you don't, then this house is going to be dirty, alright? Now, I'm going to ask you again. 
Do you understand? I don't want any back talk. Yes, ma'am. Jeez. That's what I thought. Get it done. Jeez, you always gotta be taking things so seriously. <sighs> you don't have to be so mean, old lady. What did you just say to me, boy? Go ahead and say it again, and say it straight to my face. Oh, I, I said nothing, okay. Well, actually, <clears throat> Mom, I have a real question for you. Why sometimes do you have to be so, how do I say this? Mean, like you yell at me for all the stupidest reasons. Well, maybe if you listen, and listen to what I actually say sometimes, maybe I don't have to be so mean. All right, so maybe next time, just do your chores and it can just be an easy vibe, okay? Why can't you just listen? <laughs> why can't you just, why can't, why can't you just listen? What do you mean I don't ever listen? I try my best to listen, but all you do is yell, 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 and I can't do that. And besides, mom, it's summer, so I don't really want to do chores in the first place. Boy, I don't care if it's summer. You th just because it's summer doesn't stop me from paying all these bills in this house. But hey, here we are. So since I'm paying bills, you gotta pay chores. I mean, do chores, whatever. Same thing, you know what I mean? Yeah, well mom, guess what? It's summer, since it's summer, no one wants to do chores at all. No, everyone wants to just stay inside and relax. Watch some Netflix or whatever and something and just chill something like that but i can never do that it happened last summer the summer before that summer 10 years ago it just keeps happening over and over and over and i'm getting tired okay you're not no one your name is aiden and aiden i want you to do your chores and just listen for once like you never do that well mom i have an idea for you since you're always saying this is your house and this is your rules then why don't you do your chores if it's my house I mean, this could be my room, I'll clean my room, but everything else a part of this house, upstairs and downstairs, that's yours. So why don't you do the chores? I know this boy did not just get smart with him. Okay. Okay, so, since you obviously think you run this house now, and since you obviously think you're in charge, and since it's summer, um, and you don't want to do anything, get out. Wait, what? Wait, 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 mom, 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 mom. Can you give me a full explanation on what you mean get out on this very moment so I can get a full understanding on why you're telling me, the A-man, to get out? Please, tell me. No, 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 You were just talking about how it's my house and how you, I should do, how I should do the chores, and how it's summer you shouldn't do anything. Since you don't want to do anything since it's my house, um, pack your bags and get out, okay? I don't care where you go, you just can't stay here no more. You're kicking me out. <laughs> Mom, actually, um, it's about my time to go do my chores. So I'm gonna go do my chores, I'm gonna skedaddle, and um, I'll be back with you in a second, okay? Um, peace. <laughs> oh boy! Don't make me ask again, because I'm about to be tweaking. Now, do you want to be get out this house, or do you want me to be tweaking? Your choice. Okay, chill. Look, GG's, pack your things, pack every single thing in this room, and get out. I don't even want to be reminded of you. Take your TV, take your bed, take everything, and get out. I'll be back in a minute to see if you have everything packed up. Is she really kicking me out right now? This is ridiculous. This is bonkers. I hate you. What was that? Mm hmm. Yeah, that's what I thought. Uh, yeah. That woman is a D1 crash out. Where is it? Oh. Well, might as well go ahead and start packing. For real. I can't believe this is actually happening. This is actually happening, bro. Jeez, I'm in a midlife crisis right now. All right, boy. All right. So your uncle Ford said that he would love to have you over at his house. So you got all your things packed up. Uncle Ford, 
Mom, I don't want to go stay with Uncle Ford. To be honest, he's really weird. He's annoying and there's something wrong with him. I swear, there's just something really wrong with him. Oh, really? Why don't you want to stay with your Uncle Ford? What's wrong with my brother? What's wrong with him? Mom, he licks, sniffs, and bites my feet while I'm asleep. What are you talking about? What's wrong with him? There's things way wrong with him and... I don't think I can just handle that. No, I'm not dealing with that. Okay, boy, so he did the same thing to me when we were growing up. You know what I did? I just smacked him. So if he did it, just smack him. I know you got that Mama Spanx in the gene, you too. No, Mom, I don't even think I can get used to that. Like, that's legit. That legit creeps me out every time he does it. So I don't think that's going to work, Mom. So we might as well just find something else. You know what? Whatever. Um, so the only other people that you have left to stay with if you don't go with your Uncle Ford is your grandparents, so you go out to stay at your grandparents. My grandparents' house, mom, grandma, and grandpa are in their late 80s. All grandma talks about is how hot the guys were back in 1950, and all grandma talks about is how he remembers seeing every single Wizard of Oz actor die. I mean, boy, you'll get used to it, right? So you wanna go stay with your grandparents or what? No, mom, that's not gonna work either, okay? So I don't know what else to do, okay? Maybe you should just let, let, let me stay inside, okay? Okay, if you ain't gonna go stay with anybody, then I guess you're just gonna have to be on the side of the curb, just down there, out of the house. What? Mom, give me another good reason on why I'm getting kicked out over some chores. You know what, actually, I'm not even gonna argue right now. Okay, jeez, be out on the curb, okay? Jeez. What you waiting for? Get up, let's go! What, what are you talking about, Mom? It's pitch black outside. It's 1 a.m. What, pitch black? What are you talking about? This woman's weekend. Come on now, open. It already lit up. Wait, for real? Bruh. It was just nighttime a second ago. I know I'm not tweaking. It was just a pitch of black, and now it's daytime. Look, you have the next two point five seconds to get up out that bed and go outside and wait on the curb, or else I will absolutely whoop you into the next 25 years. Okay, chill, jeez. Oh my gosh. All right, bye, room. Yeah, that's what I thought. Get up. Let's go. All right, boy. Now your new home is right here on the side of the road. Okay, let me see. Okay, Mom. So you were serious. Literally on the side of the curb. Right, right behind our house. Mm-hmm. That's what I just said. Now go ahead and sit down so I can go back inside. Mom, you do understand you're kicking me out with a stick with a bag on a stick sitting on the side of the road behind the house over three chores that you saw that I didn't do. Yes, I am very much doing this over some chores. You know how much I love doing chores and you know how much I love for a clean house to finally be in my possession, okay? Now go ahead and sit your butt down on that curb before I whoop you where the sun doesn't shine and it is daytime. This woman is crazy. She. She's insane. Oh my gosh. Dude, this is ridiculous. Like, what is the point? Mom, I just didn't do any chores. But, okay, I'm fine right here, all right? Jeez. Since you want me in this curb so badly. Now, you stay there, and if you ever come near my house again, I'll make sure you're gone. You understand? Do you understand? Yes, ma'am. I got it. That's what I thought. Stay. Don't move. And mom, you do mean me being kicked out is only a temporary thing, right? I can come back inside when it's nighttime, right? No, boy. You're gonna stay out here and you're gonna think about why you decided not to do your chores. If I find out that you came inside, me and you are gonna have a serious problem. Stay outside. What? Bro, why is she so mad for? Boy, don't I feel accomplished. 
I'm gonna go treat myself to a glass of orange juice. What the heck? I thought I could have sworn I just told this boy to do the dishes and he still hasn't done it. Okay, that's a whooping. Aiden, come here right now. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna give him a stern talking to after. Aiden, come here right now. I'm not gonna ask you again. Ah, there you are, little Jimmy. Little Jimmy, go get your brother Aiden. He hasn't done his dishes yet, and I really need him to dig deep and do these dishes. Go get Aiden. Um, I thought I remember overhearing you talk about how you're kicking him out. One of the best things I've ever heard in a long time. I'm so happy about that, Mom. What are you talking about? He's in his room. Oh. I, I guess I did kick him out, right? <laughs> oh, man. I, for I totally I forgot about that. Well, um, uh, well, since I kicked him out, I can't kick him back in. So, little Jimmy, do these dishes. No. Yes, sir. Love you. Um, go buy yourself something nice, okay? Go take the $100 off my uh, counter in my room, okay? I love you, son. <laughs> Annoying. I guess I just won't drink anything. I guess I'll just die of hydration. <sighs> okay, chill out, Mama Sphinx. You tweaking. You, you tripping. You kicked that boy out because he didn't do no chores. That boy was annoying anyways. You don't even need him in the house that badly anyways. Huh? Just, just go, just go lay down. Okay, chill out, chill out, chill out, Mama Sphinx. You're tweaking, okay? Maybe you just need to take a, maybe you just need to take a quick little power nap, okay? Cause you, you don't need Aiden, right? You, you don't need him. I mean, even though the chores make this, make even though the chores make this house actually hold up, but uh, whatever, okay? You can do them later. Just take yourself a quick little nap, Mama Sphinx. You're okay. You're okay. You don't need Aiden. Maybe I do because why am I in his room? <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> Speaking of chores, why is this boy's room so messy? Aiden, come clean your room. Jeez, I don't know how many times I have to keep telling this boy to come clean his room. <sighs> Kids, they never listen. Oh, once again, he's not here. See, I'm done. I'm, I'm done. All right, let, let me get him out of here. Forget it. I'm not, I don't even need to take a nap no more. Let me just get out this boy's room. Make no sense. Make no sense at all. Oh, man. I'm ready to release this load, if you know what I mean. Uh-uh. I know this bathroom ain't dirt. Aiden, come clean this bathroom. Why do I keep forgetting? I'm dumb. I, he's not here. Maybe I do need it in the house. Maybe he was right. I mean, I have no one to yell at. I have no one to do these chores. And I have no one to hate on. Even though I secretly may love them. No, I don't. Don't don't think I'm being solved now. Maybe I do need it. Oh crap. But I already had kicked him out. I need to go get him before he thinks I don't love him anymore. Man, I really need somewhere to stay, bruh. It's too hot. It's 193 degrees outside today. Jeez. Ooh, okay. Ooh, I finally got my steps in for the day. What the? Hey, aren't you Mama Spanx the little kid? What are you doing out here, little boy? Yeah, um, my mom just kicked me out because I didn't do my chores. She had wrote this list for me to do the dumbest chores that I've ever seen in my entire life, and I didn't do them, so she kicked me out. Really? Your mom kicked you out? That's actually kind of crazy. Well, you do remember who I am, right? I mean, yeah, I do know you. You're the crazy next door neighbor, Karen Koofman. My mom always talks about how much she hates you. Uh, not Karen Koofman, Karen Kaufman. <laughs> Anyways, since your mother obviously kicked you out, why don't you come stay with me at the next door neighbors? I mean, it would sound nice, but I don't know if I can do it. Since my mom is always talking about how much she hates you, I can't frick with the ops. You know, since you got mad at my mom for putting jelly over your front door welcome mat. I mean, yeah, but things change. You almost fought my mom because she threw a single, single breadcrumb at your car. I mean, yeah, but once again, things change. You almost went to Walmart and bought your own belt just because my mom put a single leaf 
in your plant vegetable garden. I mean, yes, things do change. And okay, who am I kidding? Look, I need you to come with me to my what? next door neighbor's house because I, I need someone to live with me. If I don't prove to the government that I live with somebody anytime soon, they're gonna put me in a mental hospital and I'm not going back. I don't even know how I escaped the first time. I just know I'm not going back. So you're gonna get up and you're gonna come with me to my nag house. You understand, little boy? Aiden, I'm letting you back in. Oh, okay. So I kick you out for 10 minutes and you're already switching sides with the worst next door neighbor that anyone could ever have. Uh-oh, things are about to get ugly. Well, 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 look who it is. If it isn't Mama Sphinx, the crazy old woman that doesn't know how to take care of her own kids. Well, 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 if it isn't the wig wearing Karen Kaufman, <laughs> you stupid little girl, I'm so sick of you. And no, I know how to treat my kids and I love my kids. What are you talking about? I don't care about them. I care about them. Oh, you do, all right? Um, let's see how you do. Come on, I thought you kicked them out. Yes, sure, I did kick them out, but let's just say that was a mistake and also none of your business. So since you're always making stuff about you and just making stuff your business, I'm gonna kick you out. Oh, you are? You and what army? Come on, do it. Me and what army? That army. All right, come on, Aiden, I'm letting you back inside. Now, hurry up before she gets up. Wait, you are, Mom? <laughs> okay, bet, screw this. <laughs>